before the real thing. Mark Wright's out of contention for the Irish match. His strained neck is still restricting him. It makes him susceptible to the expected aerial bombardment. Terry Butcher's let the whiskers grow, putting on his fight face, but he's well relaxed behind that facade. The players know the lineup. They've been instructed to keep it under wraps. After two and a half weeks here, I sense a mood of relief that they'll be let off the leash at last. The result will decide the mood of the squad. A win's great, a draw's okay. Defeat in the opening match would be a massive setback. Jack will be, Jack Charles will be the same. He knows uh, a good start is essential. He knows we, he plays us. Uh, he'll be looking for two points. He won't be looking to lose. We're the same. Unfortunately, we can't please each other, can we? You know, if we, if we get a point, we'll be a bit disappointed. He'll be disappointed, so will I. It's a big match. And their players come from the same league as us. If you look at their players, they're all in the first division. Same players, same league. Same style of football, same problems. You know, so it's not, uh, it's not an easy match for either of us, you know. And uh, it's going to be a big match. It's going to be white hot on the day. Exceptionally white hot on the day. And anybody who's a little bit fluffy here or fluffy there, you know, uh, is not going to play his part for that team. And I've got to make sure that we haven't got anybody like that in the team. So, you know, we need, we need to get off to a good result. And we know Jackie Starr, we know what Jackie will be saying. He's done a marvellous job for Ireland. But, you know, our results and our record is equally as good. People forget, I think people for, forgot that, you know. It's quite amazing, but there it is. You soldier on, doing the best you can. You just can't afford to be fluffy.